Hey fire sign. So as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Over Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a reading for our Aries, Leos, and our Sagittarians, okay? So if you in any way at all identify as an Aries, a Leo, or a Sagittarius, then this reading is for you. All right. Let us go ahead and get into this reading, you guys. Let us see what the messages are that Spirit has here for you all on today. Let us see, let us see. Thank you, Spirit. <clears throat> Hope that you guys are doing well. I am doing well, love. We have the Seven of Cups, okay? So, lots of options being presented here to you at this time. You not really knowing what to do or feeling a little bit confused maybe because somebody is coming a little bit crazy. It seems like they're trying to attack you. Could be a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius person. You're very much so confused because you don't know where this attack came from. All right, we have the Fool card, all right? So, you're like, um, you know, I feel very much so confused to all of this. All right, but you feel very much so stable and secure at the end of the day, though. You get what I'm saying? I feel here like maybe the news that you received is not so favorable, but you feel like you're stable or you're secure enough as to where you'll be able to still deal with it or you're still managed somehow. You get what I'm saying? So we have the Ace of Pentacles here in reverse and we have the Five of Swords also in reverse, both um, in the focus position, okay? So I feel like you guys may not have everything that you need in order at this time which is maybe why you feel attacked however you do feel like with the emperor here you have something of your own could be a business maybe you get what i'm saying so you're like okay i could tend more to my business and maybe that will get me this ace of pentacles okay that i need so let us see here first outcome <clears throat> We have the Six of Pentacles in reverse. All right, so a situation is very much so one-sided here. Okay, you're going to start realizing that. Could be with the relationship with the Knight of Cups in reverse and the Lovers. Some of you could start realizing that a relationship that you have is very much so one-sided. Okay, um, and that because of this, it's not progressing. It's not moving forward. Okay, that's what I see here. Y'all hear Sage? <laughs> Let us see what we got. We got the devil energy in reverse, okay? Give me one second, y'all. So, with this devil energy in reverse, you guys, it's like saying, um, you know, you're setting yourself free from this because you're, you're realizing, okay, I've been waiting on something from this person or I've been waiting on something with them and I'm not getting it, okay? I'm not getting it. You feel like you're at a standstill in this relationship. It's not moving forward. It's not progressing, okay? Let us see. We have the king of wands in reverse. So you're dealing with a very selfish person, somebody who only thinks about them, okay? What's the underlining here of the reading? Page of Pentacles. So I do feel like when it comes to, like I said, you building yourself back up, that's what you're going to do. But when it comes to work, you're going to focus on work as opposed to whatever this relationship is. That's what I see here. Yeah, nine of Pentacles. Some of you are going to take the energy that you've been putting into a relationship and start putting it into work, okay? That's what I see. All right, fire sign. So let us see what we have <clears throat> for you. Our Aries, Leos, and Sagittarians. All right. We have the Page of Wands. Yeah, so like I said, you receive some sort of news that now that you get this news, you get what I'm saying? You're very much so confused. You get what I'm saying? Because you're like, okay. I was under the impression that I was getting a lot of options, but now I feel trapped. You get what I'm saying? So somebody possibly presented something to you so that they could trap you or that's how you feel. But we have the five of wands energy here once again, so that I feel like somebody could be in an abusive relationship and we have the king of wands in reverse with a very selfish person. Um, somebody who's a karmic with the justice card here that maybe they thought or assumed was their divine counterpart. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. And now that you are stuck with that person, person <clears throat> you're like in the worst situation and you're trying to get out so you're doing everything that you can like focusing on work just so you can get away from this relationship all right so we have the queen of swords in reverse with the seven of wands we have the temperance energy in reverse yeah so it's basically the reason you feel attacked is because when whatever this queen of swords said or did what they said or did you get what i'm saying you feel like it wasn't the right time like you're trying to get other things in order yeah then when they came to bring you some message here you feel like it wasn't the right time for that yeah so it's something here where ooh, five of pentacles like i said either your money is funny right now you get what i'm saying or you're tr you know you're trying to block something out or reject somebody here okay <clears throat> 
Like I said, you was trying to get your money to where it needs to be before certain things come. Yeah. So what I'm getting with this nine of cups in reverse, you know, even though you have the business or even though you have the the, the work or whatever this is with this emperor energy, you get what I'm saying? You still don't feel like fulfilled. You still don't feel like it's enough. It's like the plan is not all the way together with the Knight of Pentacles. Okay. The, definitely not. You get what I'm saying? So the Ten of Swords here, you feel very much so betrayed by whoever that Queen of Swords is. Cause you're like, hold on. You know what I mean? Like I have plans. I have things that I'm, that I'm trying to do. So we have the Knight of Cups energy here in reverse with the lovers and the Six of Pentacles in reverse. Okay. Let us see what this is here for our fire signs the hanged one in reverse so yeah you're freeing yourself like i said okay some of you are really afraid to take this leap of faith but you realize that somebody has been cheating somebody has been doing this they have been doing that especially wow so look at the oof, jesus so we have the fool and the seven of swords with the two of wands so you're going to have a decision to make because there's been betrayal several several times okay with the devil energy here you've been trapped into some sort of toxic situation or low vibrational um relationship or something like that then you have this five of wands energy again somebody's been fighting you putting their hands on you possibly with the king of wands in reverse okay so either this person is literally um hurting you you get what i'm saying or they're like emotionally causing you pain mentally causing you pain and it is hurting you but regardless so what it's definitely a toxic situation so with the devil energy here in reverse, yeah, somebody's definitely been um, in an abusive relationship for a minute, okay? And the only reason they stayed is, unfortunately, they were under the very, very, very whew, unfortunate misconception that this person was their twin flame, okay? So with the seven of cups in reverse, you now see clearly, all right, you know what it is. King of Wands here in reverse, okay? My heart goes out to you. Yeah, the Seven of Wands in reverse. The reason this person does this is because they feel like you don't have anybody on your side. They feel like you don't have anything. You get what I'm saying? But like I said, double emphasis on the fact that some of you are going to get your money up. And you're going to be out. That's your main focus. That's your priority, all right? So if this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and haggery.